Welcome to our lecture online. Now here is a very typical problem that most calculus students will encounter. Let's say that you're trying to send a postal package and there's a limit as to how big it can be. The way that's measured is that the total sum of the length of the pa package plus the girth cannot exceed a certain number of inches. Let's say that maximum number is 96 inches. The girth is simply the circumference of the base, which is square. That means the girth is simply s plus s plus s plus s, or simply 4 times s. And so therefore the total dimension measured would be the girth, 4 times s, plus the length. What we're trying to do here is we're trying to maximize the volume of this package. So that would be number 2. We're trying to identify what we're trying to maximize. In this case, we're maximizing the volume. Therefore, we need an equation for the volume, and the volume of a box like that, whoop, there we go, this should be number three. The volume is equal to the area of the base, which is S squared times the length of the box times L. And notice that the volume, the equation, does indeed have two unknowns, the side, the side of the, the base and the length, which means we're going to need a constraint to allow us to solve for one of the two variables in terms of the other. So the constraint here, we already know, it is equal, it's, it says that the length plus the girth must equal 96 inches, or not be any bigger than 96 inches, so the length plus 4 times s, which is the girth, cannot exceed 96 inches. And there's your constraint, which means we can now replace l by what l is equal to. So on number 5, we're going to solve this for l. l is equal to 96 minus 4s and substitute that back into the equation for the volume. So for number 5, we get the volume is equal to s squared times 96 minus 4s. Now when we work this out, we get v is equal to 96s squared minus 4s cubed, and this equation we can then find the derivative of and set it equal to 0. So for step 6, we're going to take the derivative, v prime is equal to, that would be 192s to the first power minus 12s squared, and we're going to set v prime equal to 0 to solve for s. So that would now be, um, uh, let's see here, number 7. We're going to solve for 0 is equal to 190, oops, Got ahead of myself here. 192s minus 12s squared and set it equal to zero and solve for s. Let's see here. Hmm, 12. Uh, we can divide both sides by 2. So zero is equal to, that's 96s minus 6s squared. And that goes into 96 exactly 16 times, so 0 is equal to 16s minus s squared, which means we can now factor out an s, 0 is equal to s times 16 minus s, which means s equals 0 or s equals 16. Now, if s equals 0, that would give you minimum volume, of course, then the area of the base would be 0 and you have no volume, that's minimum volume, or if s is equal to 16, that should give you maximum, val uh, maximum volume. So let's try and see what that is. And also, what would l be equal to? So we can say that l is equal to 96 minus 4 times 16. That would be 96 minus 64, which is equal to 32. So we have a side of 16 inches and a length of 32 inches which means if we check that for the volume, volume would be equal to 4s, oh, not 4s, I'm not looking for the girt, I'm looking for the volume. So volume would be area to base, which is s squared times the length, that would be 16 squared times 32. 16 squared, that would be 256 multiplied times 32. That would be equal to 256 times 4 times 8, which is 1,024 times 8, which is equal to 8,196, I believe. 94 times 8, nope, 92. 
Let's see if that's right. 160 and 32, 92, that's correct. So that would be the total number of, of course, cubic inches, because everything is in inches here. And does that make sense? Hmm, let's see here. Let's use a calculator and see if we got this right. So 16, that's the GERT. We square that, or the side, square that. And uh, times 32, and 8,192. So that's how we find the maximum volume given those constraints. And again, another really interesting and very typical example for this kind of thing. And that's how it's done.